Hello, welcome to game four of the Newburyport Varsity soccer season as Newburyport take on Ipswich at the James Stalen Stadium. Coach Blue made a few changes to the starting lineup, uh, trying, trying a different formation. Uh, so the defence started with uh, Tank in goal, Colwell, Smith, and McDermott, and then Fellner moved into midfield with Acton, Aquaviva, and Gagnon, and Brooks, O'Donnell, and Twitchell were up front. Twitchell getting a reward for scoring that dramatic late winning goal against Pentucket earlier in the week. Newburyport top of the league right now and Ipswich with a record of one win, one tie and one defeat from the first three games. Newburyport came out of the blocks as in their customary style, very, very fast. Really nice move straight from the kickoff, knocking the ball around on the right hand side. Find the ball inside to, to Fellner. Fellner does a nice job, just plays it inside to O'Donnell. O'Donnell plays it inside the defender and Aquaviva cuts inside and shoots against the post. 20 seconds on the clock. Could have been, could have been an early goal. Defender clears it out to Colwell. Colwell picks the ball up and he plays it inside. The ball rebounds back to Aquaviva and this time there's no mistake. Cuts inside and hits an unstoppable shot into the far corner. So I think 40 seconds on the clock and they've already hit the post and then scored. And it's 1-0 to Newburyport. Great play here from Aquaviva. Shows great strength. Cuts inside. Good skill. And smashes the shot past the keeper. Right inside the post. Lovely goal. Great start. And Newburyport now have a habit of, of really starting games fast. And uh, that's a great start. One goal to nil. Newburyport one. Ipswich nil. Twelfth minute now. And uh, a few more. another good chance here. Uh, as the ball bounces out, the defence clear it, but McDermott picks the ball up and plays a great early ball into O'Donnell. O'Donnell turns, slots the ball into the corner. Can't quite see it there from the camera work, but O'Donnell makes it 2-0 on 12 minutes. Great first touch, takes it in his stride and slots it home. So 12 minutes on the clock, Newburyport 2, Ipswich 0, Brady O'Donnell with, I think that's his fourth goal of the season. And uh, Newburyport well on their way to another comfortable victory here. A few minutes later, O'Donnell does some fantastic skills on the edge of the box, picks up the ball, beats his man, cuts inside, curls a shot right off the crossbar. Fantastic effort, almost 3-0 to Newbyport, and they're completely on top. Ipswich can't really get out there in half. Two minutes later, Forrest Hay brings the ball down, plays it to Bobby. Bobby inside to Fellner. Fellner beats his man, plays a perfect pass, and look... Freeze frame there, Forrest Hay onside, plays it through and slots the ball home, but the referee didn't notice that the defender was behind and gives an offside. Forrest Hay wasn't to be denied there, and Fellner again the supplier, nice left-footed ball over the top. Forrest Hay runs through, chips it over the keeper, 3-0 on the clock, uh, seven, uh, 23 minutes into the game. Great ball by Fellner, Forrest Hay through on goal, keeper comes rushing out and he just chips it over him. Cool as a cucumber. Three goals to nil. Really nice goal from Newburyport. And the game's already over. Uh, about the quarter of the way into the match. Nice goal from Forrest Hay there. Great play from Fellner. And uh, he's enjoying his new role. Playing a little bit further up in the midfield. 35 minutes now on the clock. Twitchell gets in on the act. Beats his man. Tries a shot. Rebounds off the defender. And then the two defenders get in a bit of a mess. And Twitchell's just there to slot home. Not his greatest goal he'll ever score, but uh, they all count. And, uh, you know, he's there making the most of this uh, defensive blunder and just slots it in with his left foot. 4-0, 35 minutes on the clock. Great job from Newburyport. Um, walking away with the game, making it look very easy. Ipswich not really uh, able, to, able to live with them. Uh, the talent and the, uh, and the skill and the speed of the Newburyport team just too much. And so that was the end of the first half. This is the uh, final action here as the referee blows for ha the half-time whistle and Newburyport 4, Ipswich 0. Coach Blue made a few changes for the second half. Uh, Rosa and Connolly joined the action, um, and uh, but it was still one-way traffic as Newburyport were really, really dominant and uh, playing some really nice football.
first chance of the second half fell fell to Aquaviva with a little bit of defensive blunder and he leapt onto the ball, drove into the box and the keeper and the defender comes running back and makes an incredible last ditch tackle just as Aquaviva is about to pull the trigger. Ipswich did have a half a chance um, after 10 minutes into the second half. A shot from a distance, but Owen Tank in the goal. No trouble, just uh, plucked it out of the air. Newbyport with a corner here, and it leads to the fifth goal. Acton doesn't quite get on the end of it, but Fellner does. Picks up the rebound and slots it home. And that's number five for Newbyport. Good ball in here, nice cross. Acton attacks it, doesn't quite get his head on it. Defender puts it into the air. Fellner tries to get his head on it. And then the loose ball comes down to Fellner and he pops it in. Five goals to nil. And uh, a very nice goal from Fellner. And uh, one-way traffic from here on in. And the sixth goal wasn't far behind. Ten minutes later, throw in on the left-hand side. Uh, Ball picked up by uh, Forrest Hay on the left-hand side. Flicks it over the defender, gets into the box, round another defender, shoots towards the far post, keeper makes the save, but there's Jamie Brooks sniffing around for the rebound and popping in a nice finish. Good skill here from Forrest Day, just nips over the defender, takes it into the area. Good balance, takes on his defender, goes for the shot to the far post, keeper makes a decent save, but Brooks is there. Nice finish. And New Report 6, Ipswich 0. And uh, there's no, obviously no way back from here. Newbyport really playing some nice stuff. And, uh, you know, able to bring in some of, the, uh, um, some of the squad players to play for the last 15, 20 minutes. Give them some good time and rest, rest the uh, first teamers uh, for bigger challenges ahead in the next, next week or so. When they've got three away games coming up. One more chance coming up uh, in the last couple of minutes. Nice ball in behind. And here comes Lawton with his left foot. Just puts it just wide. And that was the end of the game. Final whistle goes. Uh, Newbyport beating Ipswich here. Six goals to nil. With nice goals from Aquaviva in the first minute. O'Donnell on 13 minutes. Forrest Hay in the 23rd minute. Twitchell on 35. Fellner and Brooks with second half goals to finish the game. Six goals to nil. Next game is on Monday. Away at Manchester Essex who recently beat Pentucket three goals to two. So it promises to be a tough game and a tough week for Newbyport as they have three goal, three games in a row away from home in five days. Looking forward to it.